I'm Georgia from Birds. And you're watching Mosh Cam. We have gotten a couple of gifts actually. Yeah. Um, Someone found out that I like crazy socks, like novelty socks. So I got some hamburger socks for my fan, which was pretty cool. A little scary that they knew <laughs> I live into those kind of socks because I don't. Yeah, he doesn't really like said it yeah. like that much. Whereas like I got like two books about like just pictures of puppies that I'm like extremely obsessed with them. So um, it's really obvious by the amount of um, puppies mm. that I talk about and post on Twitter and stuff. So it's because I can't have one. I can't have one, so I just pretend a lot and steal other people's puppies momentarily. I recorded one of my drawstrings on a song. I was just like, we were, was putting down some vocals and I was just sitting on the couch in, in the control room and just like popping it and it makes this popping noise. So we ended up just recording it. And recording it. Everything seems to be a good idea later on in the studio. <laughs> featuring, featuring cargo pants. Yeah. <laughs> When we played in New York once, um, this this dude was up the front like yelling, <coughs> like all sorts of lovely things about how much he loves us and stuff. So I so I went down and was like, "Hey, what's your name?" And, like had a conversation with him in the mic and he didn't like, even say his name. Yeah, I was like, "Hey, what's your name?" He's like, "I'm in love with your brother." <laughs> and I was like, "Oh, that's an interesting name." <laughs> but um, he comes to every single gig that we play in New York now, so. Yeah, because we kind of have done like tours with some of our idols. Like, um, Haim was like a classic example of um, somebody that we've been kind of fan for a long time. I'd love to Taylor. go with the church guys. We've played like one yeah. show with them. I opened up for one show. But like, they are just like such good, yeah. such good people. Yeah, they're awesome, um, awesome guys, and, and every time we kind of come across them, they're super like. Super keen to hang out and super, um, super lovely to us. And it's just kind of those those people that you connect with on like a personal level. Is um, it's almost more uh, memorable than than you'd say like um, playing with some massive star. Like, um, but for me, I'd I'd love to just go and follow that flashes around. <laughs> I think it's just really important to take care of yourself, like physically, because um, you know, it's not actually as rock star as people make it out to be. I mean, I'm sure that some people are really like rock star about it and go out every night and blah blah blah. But I'm pretty sure I'd die if I did that. Like, I'd die after one night. Like, <laughs> so I think yeah, just kind of be focused is the only way that you can get through it. And um, actually do it to a high standard, well your high standard because everybody's the worst critic. For more of this, subscribe here. Oh, no, it's down here. It's down here. On this page. <laughs>